One of Asia's most active volcanoes, Mount Sinabung in northern Sumatra, is violently erupting. It exploded on February 19th, creating an ash cloud that rose five kilometers into the sky. Why was this eruption so violent? Many other volcanic eruptions are quiet, like those going on now in Hawaii. Tourists can visit and view the lava from a safe distance, but nobody wants to get close to the erupting Cinnaboom. The answer is because Cinnaboom is one of many volcanoes of the Indonesian volcanic arc. The Indonesian arc has grown over many millions of years above where the Indo-Australian plate dies beneath the Eurasian plate as a result of a process called subduction. At this subduction zone, the thicker and denser oceanic part of the Indo-Australian plate goes underneath the thicker and less dense Eurasian continental plate. The subducting Indo-Australian plate has been under the ocean for millions of years and is consequently soaked with seawater, as well as water contained in hydrous minerals and sediments. As the subducting slab descends to greater and greater depths, it is progressively heated and squeezed, causing the downgoing oceanic crust and sediments to release water into the hotter mantle underneath the Eurasian plate. Water lowers the melting temperature of the mantle, thus causing it to melt. Because of the high pressure where these melts are generated, the magma dissolves plenty of volatiles, mostly water vapor and carbon dioxide, and carries them towards the Earth's surface during an eruption. As magma beneath Cinnabon rises, the pressure decreases and the volatiles form bubbles in the magma. Just like what happens when you open a shaken soda can, the escape of these volatiles is made more difficult because the arc's magmas are generally rich in silicon dioxide, which makes the magmas viscous or sticky. The high viscosity of Cinnabung's magmas make it difficult for the hot gases trapped in the bubbles to escape. The hot gases must explode their way out of the magma, and this is the cause of violent eruptions of arc volcanoes like Cinnabung.